This video is about the harmonic minor scale. The harmonic minor scale goes from la to la, just like the natural minor scale. But the pitch for so gets raised a half step to C. That means we have this pattern of whole and half steps so that we get a half step between the seventh and eighth pitch. But curiously, we get a step and a half between six and seven. It's going to sound like this. That's the part that changes dramatically from the natural minor scale. Why do we have to make this change, and why is it called the harmonic minor scale? We have to make this change because of the harmony, the chord structure that most often gets used in minor keys. If you saw the video about the six elements of music, you will recall that one of them was harmony, a pattern of chords that underlies a melody. In our kind of sense of movement of chords, what's often called Western tonality, we're used to hearing a pattern that goes like this. Or, a good place to remember this is from the little tag shave and a haircut. So if you've heard that, and I wouldn't be surprised if you have, you will have heard this movement where the pitch 7 is a half step away from the pitch 8. Same thing if you decide to make your shave and haircut in the minor key. the half step between seven and eight. However, going with the natural minor scale pattern, there is no half step between seven and eight. So we need to change that note in order to create the half step that leads you from pitch number seven to pitch number eight. I'm going to show you what this looks like with the blocks. Here is our good old natural minor scale. We see the half steps between B and C and E and F, but no half step between G and A. Now, we have G sharp, the harmonic form of the scale, and there are three half steps in this scale. Here's one, here's one, here's one. Remember that this change in the minor scale will not show up in the key signature. It will only show up in the course of the piece as needed to create this harmony.